so what's up? It's good. Sweet. Hey, how you doing, yeah. man? God, yeah. man. Yeah. How you doing? Yeah. 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 How you doing, yeah. man? Yeah. 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 Yo, welcome to the Count Dead Podcast. It's your neighborhood middleman, Slim Key. I'm here with my boy Devin HB. We got Jay Rico, the judge. We got AP behind the camera today. Yeah. And then tonight, man, our special guest, we got the outstanding citizens. How y'all boys doing? Yes, sir. I ain't gonna hold you. It ain't even the outstanding citizens. ain't the outstanding citizens coming No, sir. I ain't gonna hold you. I said yeah. full L, but no. Nah, um, yeah. We officially had uh, this member or disbanded the group. Um, so everybody could focus on furthering their solo stuff. That's, but that's a really good start. Man, I feel, when does that When does that happen? Um, um, you, you take this part off. Uh, this, uh, <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry, what's your name again? We didn't watch. Say, say, well, Say Sinclair is my uh, artist. Yeah, see, now, now y'all gotta introduce y'all to uh, Say mm-hmm. Sinclair. Uh, so, formerly World of see the Outstanding Citizens. Uh, we made that, well, uh, but our last tape. 2018, I think. Probably, yeah. Probably Grab that mic. Yeah. You said your last tape, what? Yeah, the last uh, group tape was on uh, 20, uh, 2018 on everything. Okay, all right. Uh, still all right. on Apple Music, Spotify, all that good shit. Go peep that. Um, I still I still play that shit, man. We got some good vibes going with the group, good, good synergies and shit, but. Yeah. So it's. It's not OC no more, but but okay. y'all y'all two be together a lot though. Yeah, man, it's my it's my number one producer right here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We've been in the trenches, uh, staying in the trenches. For sure, for sure. There's a lot of shit for that. You uh I don't know, man, it's like so like I wanna know like because yeah. I know you said um like the further like everybody solo stuff, but like, like was it something more like just No, nah, it was it was just that. I mean honestly, I don't know. Uh, no, nah, I think around the time of 2018, we all kind of looked up and we was like, damn, bro, all of us make music that it wasn't so drastically different, but at the time our music was similar, but I think looking forward, everyone kind of knew, like, I want to go in a different direction. Okay. Um, and so, yeah, bro, and just, you know what I'm saying, for the people that's out there that don't know, quick history lesson. The other two members of Outstanding Citizens were Josh Days. Um, and Lee Los. Um, Damn, Lee, my boy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And they still, like, they still appear, you know what I'm saying? They still doing cameos because we're all still tight, but less likely to hear uh, more than one of us on one song. Um, Naturally. Yeah. yeah. Naturally yeah. for growth. Exactly, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? We have to give ourselves enough space to, to like, I think it was really good that we even had outgrown the group, you know what I'm saying? Because it, it, it put even more pressure on us to do our own thing. It feels like, you know, we said we was going to do this. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I go by Soy. Everybody should know. If you're watching this and you don't know, it's Soy. Yeah. Soy sure. Log off, G. What, what, what was it before Soy? Because I, I don't know if you been Soy so long. <laughs> <laughs> Like dead ass, I don't remember what the hell was it. Now Psych- it was C? Psycho C. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was, it was Psycho wild. C for a while. Yeah, it was, it, it was what? Psycho C. Psych- Psycho C. Because we were doing yeah. like everybody had like uh, these code names that we made. Honestly, in like like ninth grade or something, bro. Yeah. And so yeah, yeah, it was it was a while. Hey, and and for real, just uh, touching in on that. Bro, for real, a lot of the times, that's that's what it be that keep the group together for so long. Like, niggas just got, niggas just go way back. You feel me? So yeah, it's right. like, for real, we, niggas might not even be a rap group. We more so just hang around each other all yeah. day. <laughs> and we rap. Yeah. And that's what it does. For real, dead ass. And sometimes you, you got to separate yourself in order to kind of like carve out your own path and just uh, figure out what it is you want to do. Because um, when I was with Yacht Club, Right. Right. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah you can mm-hmm. right. we made way different music from William Raji. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Me, me and so well, see, but the, I thought that was always Olo. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And so that was I, I didn't know if it was like a kind of like the internet and our future kind of like are they their own thing? You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Or is yeah. it just they really good friends that they always working with? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And, and that's that's what it had turned into. Mm-hmm. That's what it had turned into. It was like I right, we just two different entities. But um, yeah. We were all on malicious intent, you know what I'm saying? Everybody just yeah, it was all yeah. had different interests, different ways, you know. I seen you on your model and shit. Yeah, man. The splitting <coughs> of the group, man, it elevated me to like, I, I 
shit doing everything, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I just be seeing like, like people have the managers and shit, and be like, like we're, we be doing everything ourselves. Like we, we're our own everything. We own everything. Yeah. The studio, the music, the beats. You know what I'm saying? Like we, we, we own this shit, just holding it down. And uh, Miles, you strictly rap now. No, no, so you can I mean, I'll get yeah, strictly for me. Yeah. Uh, so what, what made you want to transition? Because you made that transition probably like three, four years ago now, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice. And the boy has some nice bars. And you join us, Jay. Play some more. Okay. It smells good again. Facts. Thanks. You know, we on rock. I'm going to eat the good one. That don't be overpowered when the gas. <laughs> it's a gas to shame, dude. Yeah. Gas. Yes, you got some more, let me introduce you to our guest. This is Miles. Right. So, call him so. And this is Welsh. Well, it's it's like Saint Sinclair. Saint Sinclair. Yeah. Yeah, like the juice. Yeah, like the juice. Yeah, like the juice. That's what see on Like the juice. Yeah. Like the juice. Yeah. Stay with well. us. <laughs> Alright, but um, what was he talking about? Yeah. How you doing? Uh, what made you, like, yeah, what made you want to make that transition? I was having a lot of fun making music, but because like I had learned how to make beats while I was in school, and so I was rapping on my own beats for a while, and then I realized I was just having more fun making the beats, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I definitely had gotten to a point, bro, where it's like, every creative is kind of like, you know, you got to think critically about why you're doing something, and I was like, damn, am I rapping because I make beats? And I was like, damn, I kind of am rapping because I make beats. That's as you should yeah, be rapping yeah, when you rap. You want it to be like that. Nah, yeah, exactly. You mm -hmm. should be rapping because you want to rap. Otherwise, it's like yeah, you want to feel yeah. yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so yeah, I took that step back, and I don't regret it. It's fun still. Sure. Mm -hmm. We uh, there's a, a flip side thing because in my transition, I was like, I don't know, I want to rap instead of making the beat. I want to rap on it. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, for real, man. For, I think as like a creative, bro, we all just dabbled into different things as mm -hmm. far as like whatever we in whatever field we in we gonna probably try it all from yeah. engineering to making beats to all that all, all that. that whatever we can do is cinematography so i look at like more than the artist you just a creative you feel me because i be fucking around with beats sometimes when i feel like yeah, yeah but hey key man hey man key beats key beats I'm a sample, I, that's what I do, I just sound with shit. Mm -hmm. yeah, is, but like patterns and drums, I don't really fuck with drums and shit. Mm -hmm. I let the other niggas do that. I just, I just hit the loop. Let me just, <laughs> let me just yeah, let me hear it rock. I'm yeah. big on the drum loops these days, bro. They be, they be keeping me alive, man, for real. I be telling this nigga, like, bro, just, just make the drum loops. Right. <laughs> I heard just that little magic to make drum loops and go from there. Yeah. Yeah. Hundred pack of drum loops. It's a rap. <laughs> All we need is the melodies from there. Right. But that's just how I be thinking about shit. Mm -hmm. I only make beats. So you dropped Saint Sinclair, and now you're working on part two. Well, so I dropped part one and part two already. You already dropped part two. Yeah, I dropped two tapes last year, man. You dropped two? You did. You did. You did. You dropped. Was it one of the uh, no, it was, uh, so it's nine songs, part one, and nine different songs, part two, in March and, uh, October. So, then I was, uh, no, it was actually ten songs, so that's 19, 19 songs. So, 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 so what's next? For Saint Saint Clair? And, oh. um, uh... I got a question. What type of, uh, what type of music you got, man? Um, how would I, I mean, I rap, you know what I'm saying, but it's like, like I don't, I don't feel like I rap a certain way. I just like I hear a beat and feel like I gotta rap a certain way. You know what I'm saying when I hear a beat. So a lot of people said like I, I sound like uh, Rob Banks a little bit. I got Tyler the Creator before, but I don't really see that. I got uh, a, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I got like, you feel like you're doing you. yeah, no, nah, for real, man. People, like, people gonna always make comparisons. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But ain't that a hard question to answer? Like what kind of music? Yeah, yeah, I, I just, but you get it so much, you know what I'm saying? And I, I really be thinking about it these days. Like, I really don't, like, have a type of music. I think mean, I just be, like, in there. Like, I don't need to be writing. I just be, like... Well, is that a, is that, is that, uh, is that a name for something? Like, you don't have, 
specific type. Let's say alternative. <laughs> so, yeah, but Jack of all trades. You know, they always try to put a label on something, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely, yeah. But I would definitely, you know, consider what they do alternative. Yeah. It ain't, it ain't the norm. You but, feel me? It ain't like the trap shit with niggas about to do. Yeah. Yeah, it ain't the norm. So it's definitely, it, if it ain't the norm, then it's alternative. It's, bro, that's, that's the only, bro, I don't know why, like, in Richmond, bro, that side of the music scene ain't take off yet, because the alternative music here is, is actually good. Uh, like, if you don't want to listen to trap shit all day, and you don't want to listen to, like, the people that can sing and people that do music, like Kid Cudi and the actual, like, a lot of yeah. vocals and shit, it, it's actually good here. I, I don't really know about, the, like, the lyricists, but I really think the lyricists got more pull here uh, than... Think it's no, and they definitely started to get pulled from up north, from like Pusha and them. Uh, uh, Union Academy and shit, Fly and again. Um, oh, yeah, I've been a long time. Yeah, a lot of them boys going off, man. He just dropped a, a dope ass video. Y'all remember when niggas were performing at uh, comedy sports? Yeah, I, I remember that. Right. Like, on all the time. Yeah, I was Yeah. Oh, and Show Pump? Yeah. Uh, West Broadway. I think about now. everybody that came that joint like damn bro uh bro even rp but even uh Fari, bro i think about that yeah, i'm like god right. damn bro. Right. Like, yeah. bro i think about so many people that come through that joint bro and we had done a show where Fari was so lit bro he had done it joint do up yeah was, i was just i knew he was in it yeah he yeah do up. I it yeah, is i bro i dap him up right before he went on stage bro he was like yeah bro i'm about to go up that joint turn i'm like all right man take your time then i <laughs> then i heard bro i threw up when i saw yeah, it i'm like damn i'm like yeah. my nigga no, but it's hella niggas that came from uh, comedy sports, bro. Cadillac Cat, um, Fine yeah. Council was up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 What? Yeah, I, I still wish it. Yeah. Like I still wish it made music. Yeah, yeah. yeah. boy, doing this thing, so yeah, right yeah. up in the man. <laughs> Playing this role for sure. Yeah, man, comedy sports, crazy. Y'all got footage from that? Um, we could probably on Earth song. I don't I think, I, I don't know. I want to see, like, if I do, it got to be on that side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to see none of my old <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> shows you said, yeah. you know, oh, man. Yeah, man. That shit. Man, people, I remember, like, some of my friends, man, they're like, you know, the group ain't together no more. We don't make the same music, you know what I mean? So they, <laughs> that shit be crazy. <laughs> They know who they are. Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. should be crazy. I don't want to go back to none of that shit. Like all that shit over with, bro. It was nice to have it though. What y'all on? Um, but all that shit over with. What y'all got planned for this shit? For like the next six months? Yeah, I'm trying to. So I have to, I'm um, going to drop some videos. I'm going to get some features. Um, I'm going to finish up some videos for the tape. We got to uh, just shot some footage for uh, some OT. I play for y'all before we uh, swear. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, we shot some footage for that. Um, that's dropping soon. We'll look out for that. Um, we get some more videos off to the last day to pack part two out now. I'm playing on this platform. You planning on dropping something this year? Uh, I think I'm going to do some singles. Do some singles? Yeah, man. Everybody do singles this year. Yeah, man. Run up the singles and the features, man. I want to start talking with some real dope people out there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, what you uh, what you think that can be better like on the, on the music scene you know, or just the creative scene? Um, and then after that, I want to talk about uh, the modern that shit you been getting into. But do you even watch it? No, I mean I, I fucking I pay attention to the music scene like crazy, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. Gotcha. Um, for gotcha. real, for real, bro. I, I think it always come back to the money sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Like it's hard to make it out. Yeah. But at the same time, everybody is starving artists, you know what I'm saying? Like, that yeah. shit, it's, it, it, don't, it don't match, you know what I'm saying? You got to get one or the other, else you're just looking for somebody to come in and find you, you know what I'm saying? You can't go nowhere, you can't take it nowhere yourself. I think that's one of the biggest parts, man. They just got to invest in themselves, invest in the, in the shit. I'm going to tell you when you're honest to me, this right here, this, 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 like, Duo, mm -hmm. keep it right there. Man. This, this is that's that's the foundation. Yeah, man. Right there, that's the blueprint. And I mean, like, like, yeah, what you need. Like this, like, and like, Soy do so much shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
he low key a manager, but he, you know what I'm saying? It ain't he really. Pro the producers always. <laughs> and, and I think it's just because they see shit different. Um, yeah. they just they just they just got a different perspective from the artist. Mm -hmm. The artist gonna you got a whole lot of confidence shit you got to do. The producer he already they be nice because he gives you the beat, so he just like man fuck that shit nigga you take this don't do this with it. Absolutely. You no, know, the producer definitely they do definitely uh, put that battery in the back and they got they be having vision. I know you got vision. And then you got the time. We build we build as a team though. You know we got the studio where we shoot shooting, shooting shit. Saying, getting the cameras up, you know what I'm saying? We're trying to do everything ourselves, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you know, I, I, I can't have all my beats coming from Soy at this point. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Right. I gotta, you know what I'm saying? I gotta fuck with the niggas who pop it, you know what I'm saying? I, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. you know, yeah. Right. that's what I'm gonna do this year, too. I'm gonna really fuck with some dope people. I got some dope people lined up. Where? I'll right. be fucking throughout the country and shit, you know what I'm saying? That's tough. That's tough. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wanna fuck with some yeah, they probably out there low-key. Low, low key. All right, now with the models and shit. How you link up with, uh, like, Sharif? How you got, like, what you mean? Uh... Because you didn't go to the Springs, did you? Nah, well, I, so I always knew about Sharif because he was just, you know, like, doing a dope model and shit. Mm -hmm. But, like... Uh, I had met him at, um... Actually, I met him. Yeah, was at the spot. Yeah, it was at the spot. Oh, it was, it was fucked was up. You remember that? Yeah, yeah, I was fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it was a spot. Uh, shout out uh, Alex the Human, man. It's her name. Um, new spot downtown. It's called the spot. <laughs> uh, closed store. But yeah, uh, they threw an opening party and Sharif was there. You know what I'm saying? I always go about Sharif. Wait, you said the spot? Yeah, the spot recording studio? No, it's a uh, clothing store. It's a clothing store downtown with like three different collection of clothing brands. Yeah, I think you know, insert name, uh, mm -hmm. you know, I'm so 804 shirts and shit, if you ever seen it. You know, mm -hmm. do bad head knot in there too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I've seen that one. Sharif ain't even that. You talking about the, 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 the pink box room? Yeah. Talking about that joint? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah that joint was a half of it. Victim of the team is the brand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Victim Fatine is the, is the is strange brand. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The but pink box was early. The pink box was in the store. But that, that's the store. That's what y'all talking about, right? Like, that's the nah, well, because uh, that was at the bottom of Chile. Across, across from uh, Chile, uh, the spot. Yeah, it's a new place. Like, oh, it's, it's a new place? Right? Yeah. 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 Okay, I ain't no man. They just opened it up. Check like, them out, bro. Beginning yeah. of the year, round. Okay. And they make popping, bro. They I seen, bro. I seen them, like, building the Rebel Jump. That's what I've been watching them yeah, and see, I linked up with Alice on some model and shit, so it's like it's all connected, you know what I'm saying? I met Sharif, but I met Sharif at his fucking grand opening of the, of hey, the bro, spot. Bro, that joke crazy, bro, because you look like a model, bro. Yeah, bro, thank you. Yeah, I, yeah, bro. That's the reason I started modeling. You know, people just kept, kept telling me, yo, I should model. Yeah, that's know. crazy. I was like, this nigga on this model shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, this nigga, he looked, I was like, bro, he looked like a real model. like. Different fabrics. Like an African kid that they picked up. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. These you know, threads ain't the same. You know what I'm saying? But I, I love that shit, bro. I love the different clothes and that. And that's what I was just about to say. I was like, and his brand fits your style. Yeah, bro. I fuck with his brand. That shit hard as hell. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shot, man. He got to be more men with him, but I see him, uh, getting it out there. Yeah, man. He, he bro. doing his thing, bro. It's real nice. I fuck, I fuck with all the local designers, bro. That's what I. <laughs> It's the lovely bro, model ladies, oh, yes. That's crazy, man. I don't know what he be saying. Uh, it's, he be it's, sliding it's the in brand. the DM. It's, it's the, the brand. brand. It's I, love it's love it's love. I love it. I love it. That's what I'm saying. That's why I fuck with bro. You know what I'm you saying? See, like, you see the brand. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, it's some hard shit. Yeah, show it's the different than that. That movie be doing this thing for real. You know what's probably, like, I always do it like, what fucked that brand up, but not fucked up, but what kind of, like, kept that brand under wraps. Is uh, V Long because just the whole V and just uh, all that yeah, shit man. and the victim of V Long. I was like, damn, they, them jokes kind of like came it's, out around the same time. This is other dude, <laughs> I, I think he's from the city too. Lost <laughs> effects. I don't know if y'all ever heard of that shit, but he's pretty big now. He's about to open up a store, I think. In, uh, from here? Yeah, he's from here. What's his name? I don't even know his name, but it's uh, his brand called Lost Effects. Mm -hmm. It's so it's crazy. 
Yeah, bro, 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 like, I was about to get a store in, like, Atlanta or, like, Florida or some shit, you know what I'm saying? That's tough. So, if I fuck with him or some shit, got some of his shit, you know what I'm saying? I just be trying to fuck with him. Yeah, bro, got this play with him. Okay, it's not bro. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that is. You, you make the right spot of niggas with that shit. You know what I'm saying? First fashion show I did, I bought two pieces off the dude I modeled for. Both of the jumps I modeled for. Both of them. That's dope. That's dope. What y'all gonna do to take them pictures? Because that was like the gold. Because it feels like a nice little thing. I can't reveal the secret location. Yeah, I don't know. Hey, man. I don't know if it's nice. You'd be surprised how my boy be cooking them up, though. Hey, no, you're a small dude. Yeah, shout out, shout out. Yeah, that is. Yeah, yeah. Well, you want to hear that? Don't say right here. Nah, I ain't here. You got some in the shit. You got some in the shit. You got some in Yeah, they didn't cross her. They didn't go in 
dropped 50 and came back. And I was still the copy. I'm like, I'm gonna drop 50. Go ahead. Put it all on that. Niggas up by 20. Four quarter. Then come back. Hey, bro. That would cost you. And then I was like, shit, I'm gonna go back to the I'm hockey. I'm not talking about these streets. And then, yeah, then. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go back to the yeah, hockey. Yeah, so I go back to the hockey thinking I had, I had a winning streak, you know what I'm saying? I go back. Bruh. Yeah. He was watching, bro. I was like, bruh, these niggas don't score. <laughs> it's 30 seconds left. Yeah. These niggas don't <laughs> score. For these 30 seconds, I win like $80. Bruh. <laughs> niggas scored three goals in 30 seconds. Damn. The score was the same thing for the, since the first quarter. And then go back and score thir- three goals back to back. Yeah. I said, bro, this some bullshit. Damn, bro. Lost, <laughs> lost. He said, who put that money on the line, Dev? Okay. Damn. Okay. So I slowed down since then. I ain't gonna lie. You said you want to try to I mean, bro, they said they don't want to basketball. We got Billy Lynch, bitch. Oh, yeah. Billy Lynch. Oh, well, it's not really a super basketball thing, but uh, three, four niggas in the NBA named Gary got traded today. That was, <laughs> that was pretty, 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 that Gary Trent? That's a crazy Gary thing. Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't remember names. What the fuck made you think of that? Gary Harris. Gary Harris, yeah. I know it's a fault for sure. Hey, man. I'm, I'm surprised at Kyle Lahr. That nigga stayed. See, y'all tried. Y'all made it. Y'all made it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised about that. You surprised about that Kyle Lahr? Yeah. I just wanted to talk about something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 I ain't gonna do Sing this for me. I'm good. Sing this for me. I don't like what cow hard around by it. Y'all gotta think the only thing. Exactly. Can we, what do we give up for? Nothing. Come on. Huh? <laughs> Not nothing. Come on, huh? Kelly. Come on, Come on now. Take it. Come on now. That's good. Kelly and. Did, did they get that crap? Give yourself a pat on the. I don't know if we trade a kid. What? What did Nesbitt do? Hit you up. What you gonna do about it? What you gonna do about it? You afraid to get drunk and fuck you on something. So that's, that's what I'm saying. I was like, bro, what the fuck? Like, y'all been, y'all been waiting on that. Waiting on that. Waiting on that. I mean, look. He got brought up. We got every fucking body. Like, what the fuck? Tell me. No, I'm just saying I don't like it. Like, y'all been, like, y'all been quiet. I feel like y'all got something up y'all's sleeve. They're trying to get drunk. Really get drunk, man. Because, I mean, of course, y'all going for this shit. Once he, once they do that little payout shit. Okay, so, so. Hey, I'm gonna let you know right now. Know you right right right. If Aaron Gordon do what he's supposed to do, then yeah, they might be all right. I'm gonna be all right, nigga. They're gonna be championship. No, they're not. This is an MVP. Don't fuck that. Championship? Jokic no. is in his MVP. He said championship. AG is not propelling him to championship. I said if he do what he's supposed to do. If he if he get out there and he play like he if he play like Aaron Gordon we we I know what's going on. I know a lot of niggas not be LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's fine. Right. I know LeBron, a lot of niggas not gonna LeBron be LeBron out. Style. LeBron out four to six weeks. That's that's fast. I don't matter. I know a lot of niggas not gonna be the Nets either. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's cool. Man. <laughs> so, right. you're that. so, so that nigga you talking about? No, no, no argument. <laughs> I don't think he got it. Bro. No <laughs> and Phoenix. And I mean, I fuck with the Suns too. What y'all think? What trade y'all make? Don't pick up. He said LeBron in the next. He like the Phoenix Suns. We number two in the West. Oh, we number two in the West. We number two in the West. I don't know. I don't know. I won't hold it against him. I don't know. Know. I, I, I've never heard no one say I like. I let niggas know that. No, number two. <laughs> I know Steve Nash, bro. Hey, I fuck with Steve Nash, though. Steve I don't know. I'm fucking with Steve Nash. Now, CP. I mean, we there. That was a crazy Nash. 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 But, but I mean, I'm gonna say that. Yeah, I'm a Suns fan in general. Once he left, it was fucking. I'm. I'm I was a big fan of Eric Blesso for a little bit. Oh, that was good. That was Chris Paul. Everybody good. Good. That's that's why I fuck with Eric Blesso. It was Chris Paul. Got that, got that, got that dog, got that dog. dog. Yeah, and he was dunking on niggas at six foot. So it was, I was like, bro, this is must see TV. I remember when he was in college with John Wall and said he was better than John. Yeah, they used to say that. Uh, Like you say that. Mm -hmm. 
Hey, look. Oh, well, that's basketball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, cool. <laughs> Subjective, right? Yeah. <laughs> Subjective. John Wall got this. <laughs> you can't yeah, be yeah. better than this. It was crazy. I went to uh, DC and I saw John Wall. He was uh, No, he was not. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> What was he doing? And Rosebar was it? Yeah, man. Like, he was like, he was walking around doing that all the time. Like, he was doing that. 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 <laughs> you, you don't think they'll fuck with that? Uh, so it's over for that. Yeah. Maybe you gonna form a dance circle just him doing that? Yeah! <laughs> right, right, right. That's what he said. Yeah, he's gonna do that. I don't feel like reaching for them jokes. You just gonna be recording that nigga? The claps. <laughs> no? Nope. Think about this nigga killing the John Wall. I'm like, who mans is this? Get him out of here. Uh, I ain't gonna fuck with him. I ain't gonna come in there and dance. You know what's crazy? I mean, I'm gonna stop dancing and come back and chill with y'all. I ain't seen nobody hit the John Wall in a very long time. <laughs> Until just now. See, my nigga. Excuse me, man. 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 Oh, that's the merch? Yeah, we have the merch. It's your home. What's up, boy? You got white? I don't even know how I ran across that. You did? I don't even know who paid her to see me over there. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. That's what you said? Yes, sir. Of course, I don't this one on my body. Not that one. But, yeah, man. I'm going to DM the order on Instagram. The hoodies are 40, that crew neck's 35, and the tees 25. Oh, you're right with scope. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's a That's a fool. You know what I'm saying? I did like them. I did like them. You know what I'm saying? I'm on Instagram, Law Order, L-A-W-D-W-O-A-D-A. Tell them about the hat. What about the hat? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Shout out to Tamsin Company. And then I see you. Uh, me, me. Mm -hmm. uh, custom, custom hero. Uh, mm -hmm. Shout out to Valenciaga. Mm -hmm. They be my shoes. Yeah. Oh. What you talking about, son? Oh, talking about this, John. The mic piece. <laughs> I was acting. How's this? How's this look? That's kind of weird. Cause you don't like <laughs> that. John looks like Steve Harvey. Yeah, that's funny as well. That was burning right. Yeah, probably on the court thing though. Hey man, you know what the topic is. What you got over there? You been scrolling, you been your laptop. I'm gonna definitely hit you up next time we ball though. We just ball last time. Oh yeah, we just, I just ball today. Oh y'all be swooping? Yeah, we're all gonna get out there, man. Oh, we got it. 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 We you know, I got that JJ ready. We're gonna have to see it. I got that yeah, JJ ready. I'm really, I'm really gonna go out there and do something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, bro, you have to be Don't put your, don't put that drum on, on your drum. I ain't throw it over there for that. I don't care. Why? Why you shouldn't do it over there? <laughs> Why you over there, Lawrence? Why you over there, Lawrence? Bro, what? City Lawrence. JJ, right? Oh, yeah. You heard him. You said the J. Hey, J. Hey, that's the flicker link. You heard the J. Ah! You gonna change the subject? It don't. Nah, I ain't wrote that. It don't flick. You wrote that. There's a slide over there. We're pressing you right now. Oh, is that him? Yeah. Hmm. Then he said, hmm. Ha 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 do not need that, John. Did you not see that pull? <laughs> what do you mean? John, you need a lighter. You need a lighter. Nigga, just pull it, John. That John was light as a bitch. 
That bitch was an orange one. That joint just burned on you. Shit on YouTube now. Yeah, you can. It's definitely on YouTube. 
no, 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 no. I'm not saying, I'm not saying like you literally can't put it. I'm just saying that John wouldn't be supported like like it was back then. I mean, but it's still there for niggas, niggas to watch it. Man, that John was wild, bro. That niggas that like was, yeah. Niggas like that shit even more now. You think so? Yeah. Oh no, Peanut Live. That joint was wild. She was funny. That joint, bro, bro, the side tie in that joint was hilarious, bro. Because it was like, you can't be mad because it's nah, a fucking Philly. Fight. Philly Everything niggas funny. That was wild. <laughs> Everything's still wild. I don't think it was exclusively a prank for Jack. I think it was just like funny shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it was just a cool ass prank. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you should be getting hair from the shawties, bro. You think you my shoe? Put my shoes on. <laughs> hey, bro, I'm, 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 I'm really about cook- to go upstairs and watch. Pink had the Jones, live. had the Jones cooking breakfast for him. <laughs> Sisters. <laughs> hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. That's one reason why I used to watch him Jones, bro. He stayed with bitches with fat asses in that Jones, bro. I see you be like, God damn. <laughs> <laughs> in the store <laughs> ah nigga a puppet bruh hey damn bruh niggas had to be there boondocks they coming back out 2022 yeah. adult swim that's next year now boom i mean of course boondocks hands down the funniest joke mm-hmm. hands down hands down i don't really think nothing else was funny like boondocks and i'm trying to think Shit. It depends on what type of humor you got. I fucked with Aqua Team. Um, what else? See, you, it depends on what type of humor you got. Yeah, I fucked with Robot Chicken. Nigga, what? You ain't fuck with Robot Chicken? I got tired of Robot Chicken. No cap. Put it like this. It was entertaining. It wasn't funny. Though. It was just like, oh shit. It was like, oh shit moments. It wasn't like hilarious. Like, ha, oh, that, that happened. Tripping. Boondocks, I could watch that joint and legit be weak. American Dad. What else? Space Dog. Space Ghost. Space Ghost. <laughs> and you know these ain't. And you know these ain't no new episodes. Wait, is that's why. But that's why. But that's why. But that's why our parents always told us them shows was stupid. Like them shows was dumb. We think this shit funny and shit, blah, blah, blah. Our parents like, that shit dumb. Because they older, they know. When we get older, we be like, shit, that show is dumb. You think about it, Spongebob, it's it is dumb as a bitch. <laughs> is it funny? Spongebob is wild, too. Yeah, I think everybody watched Spongebob at some point. And who ready? Who, who pressed the... The bomb over there, John. <laughs> the bomb. <laughs> that be time ticking, man. His alarm was going off. He can't find his phone. <laughs> so I had to call him. How you lose your phone? You ain't even go nowhere. <laughs> Don't worry about my phone. <laughs> worry about the phone. Yep. On your phone, bro. Are you sitting on it? I ain't sitting on it. Oh, every damn here. All right, stop, man. Y'all get me hot again. Oh, oh, hey, AP, can you get that? Oh, okay, never mind. This way. Hey, man, little thrill. Hey, bro, y'all niggas, I got you. Little thrill. Y'all did good in that tree. Will the thrill? Yes, sir. When you when you start calling him Will the thrill? Just now. I don't know how I feel about that job. Why do you feel any? It ain't, it ain't you. It ain't you, bro. It's just wacky. Damn. It's just wacky. Damn. Hey, no, that. 
that is a good. They did do good in the trades. They did do good in the trades. But I still don't know where my phone at. That is something back in my mind now. I was good, but then that joke started doing this thing. Dev, you got another topic for me? <laughs> I feel about marshmallow, marshmallow flavored Pepsi. Collab nah, with Peeps. Apple? Collab with Peeps. No, nah, that's nasty. <coughs> that's, I already know what it's gonna taste like. like cream. It's gonna <laughs> taste like cream soda. <laughs> Are you just saying that? <laughs> Let me see what it look like. Let me see. Yeah, it look quite that's you can't even tell. Stuff. It's just a damn can. Pepsi, <laughs> Pepsi Peeps collab. Ew. That shit the fuck out of here. Peeps. <laughs> niggas ain't Peep. drinking that shit. Peeps is trash. Man, niggas is crazy. Y'all fuck with Peeps? That don't do look delicious. Right, so you better delicious. stop right now. They they know how to they know they how to drink no Peeps Pepsi collab. That's, they trying to kill you, nigga. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's nasty. I wouldn't drink it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that is. But I'm gonna try. the look? Look delicious. Like it's good marketing. Pepsi. It's, it's, it's a good marketing. It's good marketing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's good marketing. Marshmallow flavored Pepsi. You ate the hottest? Who ate yeah, the hottest? Yeah. No, they yeah. Word. I got that shit in my ass. It's on YouTube. You got it. Oh. I got to subscribe to our YouTube channel too. Oh. I personally think I won that joke. I got it in my eye, and then I know I got it in my other eye because I spit, and then the spit. <laughs> <laughs> and then the eye, and I was like, no. Then, man, you know you got karma. Meditation. That nigga said it spit shake. Yeah, huh? You definitely won't supposed to do that. Yeah, huh? you definitely won't supposed you to got that. cartoon spit. Yeah, but that don't say. I'm like, oh. He in the other eye. Oh, oh, bro. bro. Nigga oh, spit. No. All right, bro. You ain't got to keep telling me. <laughs> You're right. Just go check the YouTube. Yeah, bro. Just, just go watch the YouTube. Bro. You ain't got to keep telling me. Right. Bro, he was good. Hey. I want to try some uh, some rare fruit, exotic fruit, yeah. dragon fruits and all that shit. Yeah, I try that. Uh, what the hell? I just what's that shit? Dirt, Durban, 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 Durban. Am I saying that right? It's a nasty ass fruit. Nasty fruit. Fruit. Nasty ass fruit. Let me look it up. Oh, it it's a fruit. <laughs> Urban? I thought you was gonna look that uh, shit up. Dog, <laughs> man, hold on, man. Look. Can't find his phone. Man. We never out. We never out. We never out. Dragon fruit is good. It might be a lot of potential moves. I see a lot of them. I don't like the red of it. There ain't no banana. <laughs> He said it tastes like kiwi. Like, yeah, a, like never, a sweetie kiwi. Like a raw sweet flavor. Mm. You never had kiwi? I have, but it's I It's called like durian. Like durian. 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 They said these don't smell rotten, but taste sweet. What? Uh, durian. The world's smelliest fruit. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, no. No, if we're out there, this expensive as a bitch. Just cause that don't stink so bad. Yeah. Let me see how much. Ice cream. Oh yeah, yeah. these don't expensive. Chicken. <laughs> they all for fried chicken. So yeah, am I tripping? I don't know where you can get this shit from right there. I don't know. Probably order that shit. Mm. Definitely got over it. Nah, eat that junk. Nah. Nah. That one? Huh? Nah. Put some cheese. Put some bread. Oh, no. Nah. Nah, I ain't gonna do it. Nigga said the smell. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you wanna, you wanna do, do it? it for the you wanna do it for the pod? You wanna do it for the pod? Nigga, are you gonna do it for the pod, nigga? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Same question you asked me, I'm asking you. Yeah, I'm gonna do it with you. Yeah, I'm gonna be right here. I'm gonna be right here. I'm gonna be right here. 
every pod. Be right here. I'm gonna be right here, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing a jump. Doing what? The fruit podcast. Eating the fruit. Yeah. yeah. We doing the podcast. I, me, me too. I That's what I'm so saying. We, so what we talking about? If we all gonna be doing the podcast, what we talking about? You said about? you weren't gonna eat the fruit. You said no. <laughs> That's that's all I'm saying. You said nah, I ain't eating that junk. All right then. So if I gave you my answer, what you talking about? Oh, well, I then I said you ain't gonna do it for the pie. You try to flip it back on me. I'm asking you. This ain't got nothing to do with me. I ain't got nothing to do this with you. It's on you. Part of it. Dang. I don't like talking to you, man. It's on you. You try to flip it on me. You know, I'm gonna go to the shave room now. I'm flipping on shave room. <laughs> I'm gonna get to go to the shave room. Let me see. He did what? Yeah. Like what? Uh, I seen that on a uh, Breakfast Club interview. What, what did he call it, bro? It's, um, I don't know why I don't trust that. Yeah, bro, I'm telling you. I, was, I saw the video and I was like, shit, I don't have to listen to it now, bro. I don't trust Jim Jones' crypto. <laughs> I feel like he'll take my money. <laughs> and then and then uncrypto that junk. <laughs> and make it cash. <laughs> 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 I feel like he'll take my money, bro. Yeah, buy a hole. Bro, Jim Jones stole from me before, bro. Stole from you? Yeah, bro. Took that shit from you? Stole my sauce. I thought you were going to say he offered to put you on a mixtape or some shit. No, no, no. He did use niggas' beat, though. Your beat? It was a beat that we made. Yeah, we made it. For, well, we ain't make it for him. We made it for five, but that y'all end up on Jim Jones on it. Which five? Uh, Atlanta artist. Or oh, somebody gave it to him. Ain't nobody tell him. Gave him. Ain't nobody tell him give him that That's shit. It. Nigga it gave no, style. no, but he made the song and then gave him the song. We ain't see no love. That, that nigga Jim Jones, niggas, niggas all in his comments. That nigga comment one thing back said, send some more. <laughs> and that's it. No tags, no nothing. That's all that was. He said, send some more. I was like, oh, man, this motherfucker. <laughs> it's a good song, a good song. It's a good song. It's called Capo Coin. Capo Coin. I don't. It's Cap. 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 Capo Coin is Cap. I don't know. I don't like that. Would y'all, would y'all get some Capo coin? No. Uh, probably not. Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie. Who do, who gonna respect Capo coin? I mean, well, I assume he made it to invest, like, so people can actually, like, invest in what Jim Jones would be. And I assume Jim Jones is planning to do a lot of network in this thing. That drone would be hard if he was, to, if that drone to get up, like, off the but I thought the whole thing, like with, I thought the whole thing with cryptocurrency was they don't know who make it. No. No, that's not all of them. Not all of them. Like uh, it's certain people that do it anonymously, and they put the the project out, and they don't really like attach their name to it. They're like a foundation, um, and they can remain private uh, legally. But then some people do attach their name to it, you know, because a lot of people are constantly working on these projects anyway. Okay, <clears throat> but yeah, that's what. How you feel about Jim Jones? Jim, <laughs> like I don't know. He he described it pretty well. It's like if you want to invest in Jim Jones, if you think Jim Jones is about to make a lot more money in the, his career, and you want to have some shares of Jim Jones, then you know go for it. But that's what's interesting. I mean, that's like especially with like his logo, like people who shop around and I don't know. It's something that would be too hard to get through with that logo. Yeah, but. It's Buy my gym coin. Right, that's, that's <laughs> I think I think Yachty and Soulja Boy have coins too. Oh, oh Louis Bill got some coins too. Yeah, and it's it's a similar concept. Yeah, everybody getting the coin. Are y'all hip to the NFT? Uh, <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. That's a little bag for them, yeah. like yeah. now. It sold for like five hundred thousand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because a crypto token in the New York Times column sells for five hundred and sixty thousand. So it's like, I guess an image of the New York Times column. That's specifically only for that person. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Right, it must be something really interesting about that article. <laughs> that's what I was wondering. Yeah. 
It, it got to be. For that much cheese? There would no be no point of that bitch being found in some bands. Oh, for real? Yeah, he just has the original copy. That's what I asked. Oh, the, the first, copy. the first. Is it the only? Is it the only physical copy though? So it's like, but it's hard to get though. It's like you can release shit as an NFT. Or you can just like have NFTs of something already released, like you know, like if whoever, like a 1990s artist, whoever the fuck, could release NFTs of their 1990s tape right now, and mm. you could have digital first releases yeah. of that tape. That's what he was saying on that joint. Hmm? I mean, it depends on how valuable the <coughs> um the uh. I don't know what you mean. I, <laughs> that doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> so he has a song, and the link to the link to it is the song that you can only play it in the song that you just played. It's a foul. Yeah. Sounds like he just has an original. Like, <laughs> it's just the copy he, of the file. Yeah. So like, you know, if they was like, you know, me like this shit right here, like Yeah, Jim Jones was on like there. NFT it and then you could still release your shit, but like you could sell this on the NFT and yeah. if people find value in the first recording of the Saints and Clair Jones. <laughs> That nigga Jim and Jones is like it's just like having a original copy. So like it's dead ass like it's it's the value it's the value you put in it. Like you know what I'm saying like or the value of what it's worth or whoever feels like it's worth that much. You know what I'm saying? Which is real crazy when you think about it. Mm. Nigga Jim Jones was telling Char <laughs> Charlemagne he could sell every page in his book. Yes, he can. Yeah, yeah, facts. Yes, he can. And that's excuse me. I think that's more. Masters having the publishing rights to that intellectual property, but when you actually take your content and then you publish it yourself, and someone pays you directly, and you work out the royalties of that contract, yeah, um, which is all available through the NFT market. Um, yeah, that's and that's what we're dealing with now, and so it is, it's pretty revolutionary, you know what I'm saying? Because you can support people directly in this decentralized way. You don't have to go to the label to support them. Um, so yeah, it's powerful. It's a lot to it, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's real it's cool, though. It. It's really cool. Yeah. It's really cool. And now it's going to be like people saying, like, buy art because you don't like the original copy of the Mona Lisa. Yeah. 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 Bro was saying like how like a nigga can like just buy a bunch of like because you can't like physical copy them though so like it's like a digital walkthrough yeah. of this, of a fucking like gallery. collection it's like a collection I don't know how the fuck that shit would look <laughs> it's like a, it's like a showcase yeah right? bro like that shit's probably cool shit. <laughs> Exactly. That's what, that's what I'm saying, saying bro. Yeah, that's like that's what I'm yeah. saying. Like, nigga walking shit, through that junk. Because this is the gateway for that. Because it's a lot of like it's a lot of artists that create stuff digitally. And I mean, I think we all post things to Instagram. You know, what I'm saying that you might have put a lot of work and your own money into. And so it's like, well, when do you see that back from just putting it on a website? And you typically don't, not unless you sell prints, which is again like based upon someone getting a physical copy of something. Um, and it also takes away from the rarity of it because it's like you're buying a print. You know, I still have the original. But um, I think for all of us in this day to, again, be able to just create something digitally and then we stamp what we want for it. Um, and then we're able to put it out into the market of just whoever. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, 
as in both sides. It's the future. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, bro. You just fucking from VR to a million dollar party. <laughs> looking at art from your fucking crib. <laughs> Never left the house. Uh, niggas pay to go to your VR gathering. Yeah, hell huh? yeah, bro. You know the vibes. <laughs> I'm you know the vibes. People pay for anything, man. Shit turned into some Black Mirror shit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know somebody doing dirt over there. <laughs> you know somebody gonna do some dirt. It always come. Make a log into the game. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's where I was going with that. <laughs> <laughs> they just said alcohol. They said the gym owner in New Jersey is rewarding those who Decide not to get the COVID nineteen vaccine with a free membership. Yeah. <laughs> people won't. You say they're rewarding the people that decide not to. Yeah. Oh, okay. It says in light of the Krispy Kreme giving free donuts for receiving the COVID shot here at the Atlas Gym, we are giving out free membership memberships to all who don't get it. We believe in health the real way: exercise, good diet, and plenty of vitamin D and zinc, and environ- environmental stress. Basically, yeah, we're giving away free memberships if you, if you don't get a vaccine. Well, I ain't getting the vaccine, so. Uh, New Jersey, though. New Jersey. If I was out there, I'd be sure. <laughs> they probably get sued for that at some point. <laughs> yeah. Like, what? Y'all promoting this shit? Yeah, it's you almost advocating for people to gather and not be vaccinated. Anti-vaccination. I mean, just like legally, right. legally, it's dangerous. So it yeah. says the governor Murphy has thrown everything he possibly could to shut us down. He arrested my partner and uh, given us over sixty citations, some of them criminal. He fines us fifty thousand, fifteen thousand dollars per day for every day we're in operation. Wait, I fines not being vaccinated. That's what the news is. That's what. He do what? He get what? It says the governor issued more than 1.2 million in fines to the gym for defying COVID lockdown rules. So you gotta pay fifteen thousand dollars every day, every day they in operation. And then total, what you call it, 1.2 million. I'll be investing in shit. Somebody tried to open up their exit door on a spirit flight. Oh, they wild. So it was shirtless. (laughs) (laughs) Bro, it's wild. Bro, what if he got that door? He said he emerged shirtless from the restroom and tried to open the exit door. What if bro got that bitch? Oh, right. <laughs> him first. <laughs> Start with him. I would have been hanging from the door. <laughs> that nigga is. You hear what he said? That nigga tried to open the exit door on the plane on the spirit flight. <laughs> 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 he had to stop in Denver to drop the passenger off with police. He tried to open that door while the door was flying? Yeah. yeah. He from the bathroom shirtless. Trying to open the, the window, like the, the passenger door, the exit door to get out. He must have did some crazy drugs before he got in there. He must have did that shit in the bathroom. <laughs> he did that shit in the bathroom. He was trying to wake him up to that. 
Let me see. I got it. Bro, what if he got the joint open? Mm, <laughs> he would have been done. They had the whole restrained by the receipt. Well, you know, that nigga trying to open the door. You like, oh. Oh, he would have been done. Wow. Man. Man. Everybody out there. Which y'all would have Y'all going up to tackle that nigga? Yes. Hey, hold on. I'm putting on my seat, though. My nigga brace him. Yeah, y'all go handle that, buddy. Bro, you rushing that nigga? Seatbelt and my phone. <laughs> y'all rushing that nigga? I'm about to get all this. I'm throwing yeah. something, though. We're going to get that bitch. <laughs> We're going to hawk smash your phone. I'm throwing your phone, buddy. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, better hit that nigga in the head. Hey, bro, they should put security on planes. If one, I think it's like one. Uh, you work at the airport, and don't notice. <laughs> How long you been at the airport? Like one marshal per flight. Like six years. Six years. Yeah. You didn't know this. Nigga said no. we ain't got no air marshals. No. On no. I don't know who told y'all that. One marshal, one marshal per flight. Yeah. What? <laughs> Nigga said they don't, they don't reply for every M. <laughs> <That should happen. laughs> maybe, maybe if they maybe if they transport somebody or they I mean, know. You usually, you usually don't know they're the air marshal though. Like they, they're, they look like regular people. That is true. Bad, That's the whole point of them. Bad, they, they like they like uh. What's the I'm people? What's the people that that be going around Target? That no, be like regular no. people. <laughs> Top flight. <laughs> On. <laughs> <laughs> On, guys, this is the air on every flight, yes. and you might you yes. you never know just because they look like us. Yes. <laughs> on every flight, I don't believe it's on every flight. Maybe flight here and there. Yeah, every flight. Yeah, you, you be like locking you people up in there. It's it, 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 it just too, bro. Every flight don't make sense. It's, that's so much. That's so much manpower. What do you say? What's the facts? What's the facts? What's the facts? No, in the United States, less than one percent of flights have an air marshal. With approximately forty-four thousand commercial flights operating every day across the U.S., it's impossible for the Federal Air Marshal Service to place an air marshal on every flight. On every <laughs> flight, that it just it's too many flights. It's way too many flights. It may be flights that they suspicious about. Flights that they're suspicious about. They say, "I oh, might got throw somebody on that jump." Like, every flight on the plane. No, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, but no, that's like it's like taking a bus. <laughs> they don't have you in the air. In, in the air, no facts. It like when 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 or the train. Yeah. yeah. They, they, now, they hopefully, they want to stop anything before it gets on the flight. You feel me? What if it's uh, or have, what if it's during the flight? <laughs> then, then that that's and that's when my question that comes into play. Why don't they have security on flights? Or why don't the? I'm I'm not sure. No, they don't. But why why don't the pilots and uh, the stewardess have some type of training, some type of law enforcement background, some type of training to where if shit go down. Put that bitch in autopilot. Y'all feel safe. <laughs> that y'all can feel safe because somebody aboard the flight know what the fuck they doing. But it, but it, secret shopper. Like it, it's, it's just too many flights to cover. Just so many people. One per flight is on. No, but you you on that joint. You on that joint with you and whoever beside you. Free so fall of that joint. <laughs> I done, I done seen I done seen somebody travel with somebody and get off the plane with somebody in cuffs. Yeah, break out off right off the joint. Keep it moving. Quick joint. He had cuffs on. on the, he had cuffs on the whole flight. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure he had cuffs on the whole flight. I won't on the flight. He just escorted him off the plane. Crazy on the plane, that's it. He's just going crazy. <laughs> He's just going to go crazy. Whoever on the plane got to suffer. That's the crazy thing about flights. That's the crazy thing about flights. 
Like, 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 yeah, if it's yeah, the bus. Yeah. It's my grandma. Yes. So that yeah. motherfucker. <laughs> I think I'm a walk. Yeah. <laughs> if it's a flight, bro, you, yeah. you yeah. got to wait until that thing land. For sure. The only, the good thing yeah. is, nine times out of ten, it's an air I love you guys away from whatever I'm going to do. True. Bro, and that's, that's, that's how many fucking airports and stations are. Unless you over this. Unless you over the ocean. Yeah, yeah, but it's some shit here. I think in Virginia alone is like five. <laughs> some shit here. Yeah. We gon' we gon' make that. 
We're gonna start at Airlines. We're gonna start at Airlines. Yeah, I know. Yeah, they're, 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 separate airports. <laughs> they can make a pod that's separate from the plane. You drop really? that bitch off and throw in the water and don't start floating. Mm, I guess. That shit going to be way better than soap and shit. <laughs> How y'all feel about the name Sky Aquatics? <laughs> no. Niggas trying to drop people off on boats. It was a hell of a Niggas in boats don't go too well now. It was a hell of 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 a hell that's what, but yeah, it's the name of it. Aquatic Sky. <laughs> Aquatic Sky, I mean that, but I, I guess that's a cool play name. <laughs> I guess. Why do you think it's something like the Aqua Hawk? The Aqua Hawk? 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 Well, I thought we were talking about planes. No, 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 no. We don't make planes. We make planes that can float in the sky and sink. I mean, I mean, they can fall from the sky. Oh, I got Majestic, you, I got you, I got you. Like parachute, yeah. and then we made flotation devices. Right, so what was the first one? Aquatic what? That was the sky Aquatic. Air, I think the air is trying to drop people off on pods. Air flu. <laughs> like this halo. This ain't halo. Look at that. I have no idea. <laughs> Bro, halo. That's going to be so what much money. <laughs> so yeah, niggas oh going to go broke with the first pod. Bro. <laughs> then <laughs> I'm taking that job on Shark Tank. That's what it is. <laughs> Mark Cuban, yeah, yeah, Mark Cuban, Mark Cuban. Hey, he's been playing up yours for a long time now. He's like, you can use these cards you. at your games. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> you gonna have hella crazy. Sell out. Hella crazy. Oh, man. Man. Sell out. Man, what y'all got to talk about? <coughs> Shit. That's all. Okay, well, let me play on this music. Okay, okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Play us on. Play us on. I was about to say, I hope so. I hope so. I got that. I don't see no pumps this for a while. So you ain't got Bluetooth. Now that I told you what the videos have been like, I got all these JT's and everything like that. Don't sign up, get my dog. I'll be JT's and everything like that.
Sims, man. Appreciate y'all fellas coming through, man. Y'all know y'all can pull up anytime. Y'all can pull up just to check your own family. Y'all can't even look at shit. Y'all can just come roll up.